Hi everybody, today I'm going to go over a product that I got from FlashZebra.com. Basically, what I got was the Optical Slave. The one I got was number 0127, and this is through a mini mic. I'm pulling out here. And that's pretty much how it comes packaged. And you see over here it's a mini mic plug. Uh, this is basically the sensor. And the other thing I got was 0135. And this is basically the hot shoe adapter. With the mini mic plug. So the way to use this is you have like something like one of these. Uh, this one in ca this case is a 430EX. And I'm just going to take it off. Okay, and then after that, I just plug this in here. So it basically it connects to the hot shoe, and then you have the sensor, and then you could use this foot over here, place down. Uh, unfortunately, there is no way to tighten this, so that's just one problem. But other than that, it it does pretty pretty much stay on its own. You don't have to really do anything. Alright, so let's just see how this works. So generally the way you would do this is if you have another camera, uh, this over here is my trusty Fuji X100. Basically the flash from here will be received by this sensor over here and it will trigger this flash. So what you normally do is if you will hold something like this, uh, you hold at your your subject that you want to look at and the flash will be over here and then you could aim it to however you want and then when you fire it will fire this flash too and use this saw over there it fired so and you can just show it again see you see the two flashes now what I like about this is the range is actually pretty good so right now I'm going to stand about 12 feet away. Okay, so I'm pretty far right now. And the flash fired. Hopefully the camera caught that. So, this again is very nicely built. No, it's pretty durable. It's pretty reliable. I've been using it. Uh, I'm not going to have videos on teaching you how to do the, the taking the pictures with the two flashes, but um, I'll probably have some links on the bottom over there of some other people. But this is a pretty fun new toy I have. Um, the problem also that I just have to mention that this does not actually control the output. You have to use the LCD um, lowering the power manually. So that's how you would control it. So if you have a flash that does not have the ability to control the flash uh, output such as uh, the 270 and maybe some of the lower models then you can't uh, control the flash. So you will have to probably do covering um, various other methods to do this. But if you have a 430EX you're able to control the output. So then you could control how you want the picture to look. So again, this is a nice product that I got from Fresh Zebra. I bought it myself. They didn't give it to me. So thanks everybody.